just I've just been wondering how to take this one. All right, um, this person says, "What happens when a step parent doesn't like a stepchild?" And I see that my stepmother doesn't like me at all. You have a stepmother. That's the question. Oh, when a stepmother doesn't like a stepchild, you see, um, it's that's why people, um, mentors of relationship keep saying that a breakdown in family will result in a breakdown in the society. A, so a breakdown in families will end, will result in the breakdown in the society. You see, when you have mother getting out of the house or father getting out of the house and then a new person is brought in, take it from me. It takes the grace of God for a woman to take care of someone else's child as if it's her child. It takes the grace of God. Some are, very, some are very good. Some are very fantastic. In. Some are very, very nice. I have seen a woman, shout out to Mommy Tessie, very beautiful woman. She got into the home and took care of the children much more than their mom would take care of them. Some are like that. But some of them are a sorry case. Patients is all cool. In the movies right now, they will make your life a living hell. I, 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 I got a call from a young lady some time ago telling me the father married a wife because her mom passed on. And this woman will make them go downstairs, five floors, to fetch water. And the water is running in the bathroom. So she'll make them fetch water, carry it on their head, and bring it upstairs. it upstairs, and pour it in the sink. To throw it away. Throw it away, yeah. That's the punishment for them. Maybe you slept without washing the dishes, or you did something very minor. She gives them that very hard punishment. Hmm. starving them with without food and the father is present and the father is present and you see she made me understand something i said does your father not ask if you if you have eaten when he comes back she'll be like our dad only asks us have you eaten he doesn't ask if you're satisfied and this lady was giving me the reasons why she went into prostitution how can you beat that all right, it's still hard conversations on this Friday edition of uh, Bumper Breakfast. Uh, there's an Hester hard conversations. And um, this one was quite shocking to me because this lady in question is a type 1 diabetic patient. Okay. Her mother is late. Her father not wanting the daughter to be alone. You know, one child got married to somebody else. And uh, the woman at the beginning was very helpful very friendly women generally are friendly but when never she has crisis then she becomes wicked mm. so it's like you're, you're living with two different personalities in the house she's nice some days she's nice when you're okay but the moment you get sick then she's a devil that's the way she is and the girl has concluded that her stepmother does not like her should she tell her father? Meanwhile, the stepmother has not given the father any other child. Is it the stepmother's job to give the father a child? No, can I, I correct say, you on that? Yes, you can. But I'm just saying, I'm saying that it's not that she's paying more attention to her own children. Okay. That's not the case. Okay. Here. So she doesn't have yet. You understand what I'm I saying? I do right now. She doesn't have her own kids yet. So she's not paying attention more to some and abandoning this one. They only have one child. So both father and stepmother have only this girl. But she has concluded that with the attitude of the stepmom, she doesn't like her. Now should she tell the father? Tommy saying that's why it's very important that parents should bond with their children. Even if you have your wife um, left or your husband left and um, you have um, a new person in your life, there should be a relationship, there should be a connection between um, you and your kids. You must have time to time, father to daughter heart conversations. Mm. It's very important. You see, um, I, I would say here that parents, 
should give their children the opportunity to see them as best friends are you with me yes because it's important if you do not if you do not see your kids as your best friend it's going to be a very big problem it's going to be very challenging for them to communicate with you and you see i further have a problem where a young girl who is just seeing her menstrual circle mm -hmm. is scared of talking to the stepmom okay so let me let me give you one solution that okay. since you already said um that as a father as a mother whichever one you belong to yeah you must have intimate relationship from time to time conversations and intimate conversations yeah. with your children yes regardless of the sex yeah now there is the inclination that girls you know um, if i'm going to advise this girl i'll say girls are seemingly always closer to their fathers true Very my father true. is late but when i started flowing i started flowing at 13. the okay. person i went to was my dad i didn't tell my mom the perception in my house is you know my mom sure the perception in my house is my mom is wicked the strict one not wicked no when we're growing up we had okay the, okay we had that the was the perception. wicked mommy you know and the nice daddy you know it's always it's always one wicked one nice exactly so they had a good cop bad cop system but going so well my heart goes out to those who had a wicked mom and a wicked dad <laughs> You know but it was really lovely for us because we always had somebody to report to and all of that but we had so much conversations with our father okay we had so much gist so much so that the first time i saw blood the person i went to was your dad, dad i dragged my dad into the bathroom and i showed him you know i was changing my pants each time i just go back to the bathroom and quickly change it and wear another one and i was toiling up the until he came back from work my mom was home, but I was scared of telling her because I wasn't sure if she was going to beat me or something. And then when daddy came, I dragged him into the bathroom and I showed him. Then he went out. I'm sure my mom, if she's watching this.